Now that the title of my presentation has caught your attention and drawn your much deserved skepticism, let me go ahead and ask you guys to close your eyes for a moment. Go back to that time when you were a child and how you went on those amazing family road trips. How you looked up to your parents as being these omniscient beings that got you from place to place. Honestly, with their magical map reading skills. Now fast forward what seems like a million years and come to the present. Appreciate the impact that GPS is having on our daily lives. Dynamic real-time mapping. In my research, I'm looking at exploring the endless possibilities that GPS-like navigation gives us inside the operating room and frankly, inside our own bodies. Every year, 585,000 people die of cancer. A considerable number of these people succumb to the disease in the kidneys. With the advent of medical technology, our approach to dealing with kidney diseases has gone from open surgeries to minimally invasive procedures, often just using needles. It may be to actually acquire a tissue sample or to go in and treat the disease. During this procedure, surgeons are often guided by using static anatomical maps that are often generated using CT scans. This is done in order to actually target the place that we're looking at. There is a problem though. When patients undergo certain procedures, they can often be exposed to multiple such scans, and this exposes them to a higher risk of radiation. In, a, in the young ones, it is especially important because there is a potential that they might be at a higher risk to go on and develop cancer. Always made me wonder, are we actually giving cancer to treat cancer? To address this in my research, I'm using state-of-the-art tracking systems and algorithms to pinpoint the location of needles inside the body with respect to anatomy and in real time. I use the amazing capacity of the ultrasound system and then enter the fascinating world of statistics. If I took you guys and the 50 imaginary friends I have in this room and statistically analyzed your kidneys, I could generate a shape model of the mean shape of your kidney and capture all your individual shape variations as part of the standard deviation. By doing so, and combining the ultrasound images with this statistical shape database, we can then go ahead and generate some anatomically accurate models that the surgeons can then navigate in real time. They can do this with precision and confidence. By doing so, I believe that potentially we could eliminate a number of scans during this whole procedure, thereby reducing the risk of radiation exposure and actually making these pr procedures affordable. I know my title is a hyperbole, but I do believe that this is a small step in the right direction of making high-tech, state-of-the-art affordable healthcare possible. And maybe someday, this is going to be a giant leap to helping someone's life, not only in the United States, but in resource poor locations all over the globe, and especially so in my country, India. Thank you.